Hello guys, so this is how I made the unicorn, the horn of the unicorn. So I bought this one, I bought a template from XA, which it was really cheap, maybe $2, so I just put it in my silhouette. But if you do not, if you don't, you didn't buy it, you could just also go to Google and search a horn, save it in your computer, and then transfer it to your silhouette cameo. But like I already have my template, this is what you will do if you have to make a big horn that doesn't fit your screen like we always know we always want to cut something and then we're like oh my god but this is only 12 by 12 so we can't even make bigger than that what can we do so this is what you could do i made mine i think it was 23 so there you go there's 22 inches so after you go ahead and do that let's go ahead and the first thing we got this is the side that we want so let's just select it and let's go and ungroup it ungroup and let's take out this part because this one we can fit it in our screen um you see it's all separated so we really do not need to cut that one out this is the one that we really need to cut out so let's just go ahead and put in our mat and it looks like right there let me make it bigger so you guys could see it better okay so right there it will be able to fit the mat that size so what we will do is we will get a square a regular square we'll make our little square and then we're gonna color in the square so you guys where is the color right here so we're gonna make a red after we make that color red we are gonna make as big as our shape or whatever we're doing let's make sure we cut the whole thing the right way so right there should be good. So after we have it, we select it there. Let's just go and zoom out so we can select the whole thing. Let's cl click on it and select the whole thing. Once we select the whole shape, we will go to modify. Modify, and after we are modified, we will hit divide. So after we hit divide, as you can see, it got divided. See, so this is the one piece that we need that we're gonna cut out by itself and then let's see if this one fit or if we have to cut more you see like this one don't fit so we will have to make another square and do the same step that i just did all right guys so now we're here after we did the whole process then we have to cut it cut it out into pieces for example i cut this one out and then this top piece is cut out after you cut them out then you're going to put them together and you are going to tape it. I just put a little bit of tape down here and put them together, a little tape down here and put it together to hold it, the whole piece together. So this is what it left us with this whole piece, the whole thing together. So after we have all that, then I cut out the gold pieces. These gold, they're so pretty. I don't know if you can see it on the camera very good with the light, but these are so cute. So after we do that, we will, put some tape on the back and then we're going to glue it in the middle so let's make sure we put it in the right size I think that should be good there so after we do that, we got to the second part, which she is this one. Oh, hold on, I did it wrong. It's like that, yeah. So let's just put some tape, double side of tape on these things. And we're gonna put it right here. And put it together. And then, this one and I'm gonna put it right here guys look how pretty this came out so this is our little corner big size Dude. and this is how we will do it and then just put it on the wall and it will look so cute. 